Okay, so what's up guys, I'm Pixel Sami and in this particular video, this is a pretty simple video. I'm going to show this epic glowing typewriter effect. We all know what typewriter effect is and I'm going to add a little bit of touch of my own by adding a glow effect into it. So first I'm going to show for Final Cut Pro and then I'm going to show for Premiere Pro. So let's get started. So in Final Cut Pro, this is the footage which I have taken. Now in Final Cut Pro it is pretty simple, just go to the title panel, type in typewriter, drag this typewriter effect onto the clip. Now I have chosen the font as American typewriter but you can choose anything which you want. And then write whatever you need to. And then as you can see the typewriter effect is ready to be used. But I am going to not stop right there, I am going to add a glow effect into this. So you know to add a glow effect, just click on the title panel, scroll down, as you can see there is outline and there is glow, hit both of them, click on the glow, choose whatever color you feel like, increase the blur, maybe until the outline you don't need that and increase the radius and choose whatever color which you feel like maybe this one will be good for this one and you can choose the blur as anything which you want you can choose 25, you can choose 100, you can choose anything which you want and you can play with the opacity also for the glow effect but this is pretty much it for the glowing typewriter effect for Final Cut Pro and it is pretty simple to use and you can use this anywhere on your videos and it will look really really good so that is pretty much it for Final Cut Pro and this is the final result after the rendering and the color grading So in Premiere Pro also it is pretty simple to use but it is a little bit lengthy. So first just write a title on the screen and then as you can see in the effects control panel click on the source disk and click on the keyframe button and then type the first letter and then go to the next frame type the next letter and then go to the next frame type the next letter again and then keep on doing this until your entire statement is finished and as you can see the more you write a new letter a new keyframe is formed in the animation panel and that is how the typewriter effect is made in Premiere Pro I know it is a bit lengthy compared to Final Cut Pro but the effect is entirely the same so that is pretty much it just for tutorial purpose I am going to just write hello and if you want to write it as a longer sentence then make sure each and every letter is placed at a separate keyframe and that is pretty much it now the typewriter effect is ready now after that I'm going to add my own touch which is the glow effect glow effect also is pretty simple to use just what you need to do is just copy this clip on top of it just like there's two clips and then go to the effects panel type in Gaussian blur and drag the Gaussian blur on the lower clip and then increase the blurriness for the lower clip just like this and then if you want to change the color of the text then you can change the color of the text as well and after you do that the color of the glow will also change along with the text so your neon effect or the glow effect for your typewriter effect is ready to be used and it is pretty simple to make but compared to Final Cut Pro it is a bit slower but the effect is entirely the same thing and this is pretty much it this is the final result after all the color grading sound effects and proper adjustments thank you so much and have a nice day